to prepare your analysis, first, let me open up the original wind farm analysis tool. So here I click edit to see what's inside that analysis model. You can see it's a very long analysis. It has some select layer operations, copy feature in the middle, some near analysis, and the copy feature in the end. So in order to um, speed up the analysis process, I have opt optimized this um, analysis. So let's take a look of the optimized one. So here you can see uh, I remove the copy features in the middle. You see the original one, there is a copy feature here. And I remove that copy feature. One of the data used by this analysis is a road network here, road. And let's take a look of what the road network looks like. So this is the original road network. And you can see it's very complicated, especially in the, in the city center area. But as for this study, we know wind farms could not be built in the city center. So I did a simple ERIS operation to remove those complicated networks inside the city, around the city center. Let's see the holes here around Edinburgh and uh, other major cities in this area. Once I've done that, you have your optimized wind farm model here. Because I'm in Pro 2.5 and I developed that model in 2.4, so I recreate the model to make sure everything is in good shape with 2.5. And once I open it, it's exact the same analysis as I did with the 2.4 model. So it's just close this one. I didn't change anything. Open the model and choose corresponding layers and give it a run. Once it's finished, you can open history. You can see there is a new history atom here, and the result analysis, the result layer is here. If we turn off all other layers, this is the proposed wind farm areas. Mm -hmm.